find Mr. Fluffy Ears. We'll go look for him then. Mr. Fluffy Ears, are you in here? Maybe Mr. Fluffy Ears went for a swim. easy to get lost in here. Maybe the doggy ate Mr. Fluffy ears. Mommy, mommy, I can't find Mr. Fluffy ears. The doggy house, I took the closet, I even checked the toilet. Did you check your little brother Theodore's room? <gasps> Do you think he would kidnap Mr. Fluffy Ears? Well, he did try to take your unicorn and activate its powers to destroy his daycare. Thank goodness he had to go to a psychiatrist before that happened. Go look in Theodore's room. If he's acting all evil and stuff, just call. Okay. doing? Is that Mr. Fluffy Ears? He won't be Mr. Fluffy Ears for long, Maisie. What do you mean? You see, Maisie, I have taken your precious Mr. Fluffy Ears to turn him into Fluffy Stein. Together, we will achieve world domination. Once this lightning rod has been struck with lightning, he will be a great and powerful beast. No, not Mr. Fluffy Ears. My dear Fluffy Stein, carrots are one thing you shouldn't have. They are terribly healthy and stupid. Carrots not stupid. Fluffy Stein mad. Oh, Theodore, 
all wraps of carrots. How could you say that? No, not my evil blankies. Bad bunny, bad, bad bunny. Mr. Fluffy Ears, what do you think you're doing? Just because my baby brother is a huge butthead doesn't mean he need to make his room look like the poop that comes out of it. Me sorry. Theodore Richard Clausen, what do you think you're doing? I had to stop my embarrassing mom's dancing CD just to come in here. Mom, Theodore tried to take over the world again by taking Mr. Fluffy Ears. Young man, you are in so much trouble. How many times have I told you, you can't take over the world until I've kicked you out of this house? We're gonna have to have a talk about this in the punishment room. No! Curse you, Maisel and Rose Clausen! <laughs> I love you. You got Theodore in trouble. You can be the new host of my tea party. Fluffy Stein lived a fantastic life in Maisie's room, and he was, in Maisie's words, the bestest host ever. Maisie always fed Fluffy Stein carrots, and in return, Fluffy Stein loved Maisie until his dying breath. But Mr. Narrator, evil fluffy toy bunnies that are alive don't die. Fluffy Stein loved Maisie forever and ever. The Carroty End. <laughs>